Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. We're going to be talking about this 2011 Volvo XC60. It's a T5 and it's an LE. So it comes with Xenon headlights, electric tailgate, navigation, and the list goes on. It's got the T5, which stands for Turbo 5 Cylinder Motor. And it's got a nice set of Michelin tyres all round, which actually look very new indeed. It's got memory, electric driver's seat, an electric passenger seat, and it has actually only travelled 54,000 kilometres. It's got Distronic cruise control, so you can control what sort of distance you want to be behind the person in front of you when cruise control is set, which is a very good feature to have. It even warns you via a red light at the top front of the windscreen there um, if you're too close to the person in front of you or if they brake suddenly and you may not realise. It also has navigation and reverse camera. Lane keeping assist, blind, blind sight assist. So if someone's in your blind spot, a light comes up here. So it's a very well optioned car. The T5 is a fantastic engine, it's got plenty of power, yet it's still nice and smooth and surprisingly economical. This is a front wheel drive. They are available in an all wheel drive. Uh, the good thing about the front wheel drive, I guess, is that these cars never get taken off road anyway, and you're going to spend a lot less money on fuel. People don't realize how much more fuel an all wheel drive uses. It's got nice soft leather seats, a very good service history to it, which is good because some people who do only very few kilometers like this person stick they think they're sticking to the service intervals by servicing it every 15,000 kilometers it's actually 15,000 kilometers or 12 months um, some people choose whatever they feel like whereas this one has actually been serviced what looks to be every year um, it does also have the very nice multi-spoke shadow alloy wheels um, look I think it's very good value for under twenty thousand dollars safe economical reliable it's got the Volvo name behind it some great options two keys which I understand is standard unfortunately over the years the spare key often gets lost especially with family cars you leave the spare in the glove box leave kids in the car go to the shops and the key disappears um, as I said, it does also have xenon headlights. It's got the amber daytime running lights, xenon lights. It's got daytime running light lamps here. Um, you can tell if it's got the Distronic because it's got this little box here. So it's located behind there. I believe it's got city safe as well, which will break you automatically in traffic if you're not concentrating via this system up in the top of the windscreen here and look I think generally speaking it's just a particularly good car I mean I always say you can tell a lot by a vehicle's previous owner by the tyres in fact it's got Michelin latitude tyres all round and it's been well serviced I think it speaks for itself but yeah it's a very impressive car great for a family distance of driving around town the D D5s, diesels, are good, um, but you've really got to get them on the open road. Otherwise, you get clogged DPF filters and things like that. Whereas a Petra, you could drive it to the end of the street and back every week, or you could drive it, uh, you know, 100 kilometres a day or 200, 300 kilometres a day if you really wanted to. But we are very impressed with this car. I don't think it's going to last very long at this price with such low kilometres. Um, we can help you with finance. We're conveniently located in Sydney, close to Sydney Airport. We've been doing this for over 20 years. We specialise in European cars. And I'd say we've probably sold 30 to 40 XC60s by now. And so we certainly know what to look for. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. We look forward to hearing from you soon.